as it happens, I, I hear that she's been kept apart from all the other prisoners somewhere in Naples or in one of the prisons. I believe she's been kept in the corner of a barracks within the prison compound. She always will say she is well, but I, I, I can't know for sure what her health condition is, and I hear that she is not well. I don't know anything more than anybody else, really, because I don't have any contact with her. There, there may be some indication that she will be moved back to University Avenue in Rangoon. The military will not substantiate those, those uh, rumours, but uh, I think it's quite clear that they will have been to meet my mother. It's quite clear that all the charges are completely fraudulent and she wasn't given any sort of a fair trial whatsoever. So I, I don't really take them seriously. It's a Mickey Mouse court. I don't, I don't know what to say about it, really. It's so ridiculous. They try, try and pretend to be good Buddhists and nobody believes anything like Min Aung Lain carries some monk's coffin that shows that he's a good Buddhist. Mm -hmm. These Buddhists, they aren't even good Buddhists. The monks that he's carrying the coffin for, who, who are they? They're taking money from the generals to support their monastery yes. and avish lifestyles. Well, all, all the international governments are failing to do anything meaningful at the moment. Uh, mm -hmm. They need to start actually applying a complete arms embargo on the military for starters, that would uh, go a long way. And even supporting the people who are opposing the military, it doesn't need to be with arms, just in basic humanitarian aid is all they need, more than anything else, you know. And I, I, can't, I can't approve of fighting at the end of the day, but I can't ask the Burmese people to lay down their arms and expect the military to just shoot them, because that's what they're doing. In terms of aid, obviously, the storm that has recently hit Burma has affected things terribly over there. And it's getting no news coverage whatsoever. Whereas the storm that's hit India recently, that gets coverage. So I don't understand why there's nothing coming out of Burma about this. There's a lot that can be done. People need to start working directly with the people of Burma and not trying to work with the military to get aid into the country.